Hey guys, we're continuing where I left off immediately. I didn't make a long break, I just wanna get this done. I wanna get the power tools and, you know, at some point wanna make sure that I fulfill all these quests uh, for Far Harbor, for the population. Especially since in the last episode we figured out that there seems to be some sort of way to get rid of the fog. So, yes, obviously I'm considering doing it. I hope there's not some sort of... Oh, what do we got here? A legendary glowing... Oh my god, I am so dead. This is not good, people. But he has already seen me. So, let's do it. I think I think I'm taking some some uh, here. What do I take? Like this one for sure. And um, probably do I have mentats left? Mentats, mentats, mentats. Sure. Anything that gives me back AP. Nuka cherry. Sure. Let's drink it. Should I do this? I have plenty, so... And I have Eddie, though. That's not really helping. It's going to mutate any minute now. Oh, it doesn't! Not that it's an Whoa, I hope the loot is worth it. Relentless Radium Rifle. I have no idea what that is. It's a 45 millimeter rifle that shoots a radiation with normal bullets and refills your action points at a critical hit. That is indeed pretty darn awesome. Um... I will net let Nick carry hey, it for now. Here. Let's see if he had anything worth taking. Sure thing. Do it. Grab anything useful. Two. Done and done. Check it out. And three. It was three items. He's got all of them. I know it's cheating, but I just don't want to go back right now. I could go back, you know. Just put this stuff. Ooh, there's shooting. Yeah, I'm definitely saving after that thing. That was scary. Actually, you know, if it would have mutated, that would have made it a little more interesting, but a lot more dangerous, I suppose. Oh. Well, that was the end of that. We see this guy. How many can we see is a tap a trapper? So I would say there is only that one guy we can see right now. And if he stops for a second, I might be able to blow off his head with a Ah, oh, I hate this mouse right now. Nope. Something out there. One shot didn't do it. The second one did, though. Yeah, I have to go this way. I don't want to swim. All right. Hey. I'm all ears. No, no, no. I don't want to talk to you. You just follow me, and we got this. I think. Nope. Not from here, though. So I have to go inside the building. That's fine. Let's see how big that building actually is. From the inside. That's a lantern. I'm not interested in that. That's a Pulaski shelter. On a budget. Oh, look at all these locations. I still have so much to explore. 
And I don't know how long I've been in Far Harbor already. This is uh, this is great. And remember when I when I pitched like we might end up having more than 200 episodes? Well, guess what? This is 151. And obviously we are not done with um, with Far Harbor. And we haven't even started Nuka World. <laughs> and um, there is probably some more stuff going on in the Automatron. And I also think there is a wall that you can build yourself. Kind of. <laughs> so 250 it is. I'm I, honestly not sure. So these are ghouls. And the other guy was a trapper. Hide bundles. Yeah, you did not expect that, right? You did not expect that. Ooh! Look at this angry guy here. There goes your leg. Oh, he has mutated. <laughs> nope. Here. Anyone you walk away. What? Thirty percent chance to ignite melee attackers once every twenty seconds. This is interesting. It's a pretty cool item. Especially should I really consider uh, going more melee with Allison. There's a lot of hides here. Look at this stuff. This is pr leather and more leather. We have a basement. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, Nick, get him. Yeah, I was, um, I kind of slipped off my hotkeys. And then I wasn't able to get the right one in time. That's what happened here. Pretty dangerous, huh? Okay. Let's see what else. So the... Oh, that guy was still alive. This guy is not. He got a lighter. And I would not let get him up. Let's go into the tannery and see what's what. <sighs> this is fun. <laughs> okay. Now, I think what I'm going to do here is um, take some red away. Just make sure I'm healed up fully. And I think I'm going with this. Are they inside? Hang on. We're in for it now. Can I throw this through the window? Nah, I cannot. Unfortunately. Would have liked to... Uh, throw a grenade inside. That would have been fun. But I can't, so let me just do this. That's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it. Oh, did your leg come off? Again. Actually, not too bad as tactic. 
So, what you got? Defiant 10mm pistol. Yeah, probably good for selling. But the rest, not so much. Let's see what else we got here. A quick maximum capacity hair trigger combat shotgun. Ooh, that certainly is interesting. I'm not interested in the leather. There's another safe. Let's see what. Ooh, ooh. Good thing I buy lockpicks whenever I can. Got it. Only wasted one though. Okay, what else? Prevo money. I leveled up. Will you look at that? Some economy wonder glue. Oh yeah, there is, there is guys here. Here, let's just see what happens. No? There he is. That was nice, that was nice. I like this a lot. Ooh, there's more of them. It feels a little bit like... Um, I've been playing XCOM lately, XCOM 2 a lot, with the uh, War of the Chosen update, which is really cool. And um, one of the mechanics there is uh, the Lost, basically the same as our ghouls here. And as you know, XCOM is a turn-based where everyone has like two actions. Except if you go against the Lost. Because in that case, uh, if you kill one, you just get a free action. But you have to kill him. Just wounding him doesn't work. And you can shoot at them as long as you have ammunition. So the, the main issue with that is that you run out of ammo on your weapons. However, if you have like reloaders uh, and auto free reloads and shit like that, you can just keep shooting and they fall relatively easily. Oh, future going one. Hang on, this guy is uh, a little tougher. Here. Anyone you walk away from. I got the tenery key. I think I heard something. I might be wrong though. Maybe it was just his death snarl. Or oh, whatever. More hide. Power tools. Okay, we have the quest item. Um ammunition. Um, Nick? Nick, where are you, buddy? Heads up. Do something for you? Yes. See if there's anything there. Good plan. Yeah, go there and check it out, buddy. I want you to take this stuff. Nope, I can't command him through this. No, 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 wait, 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 Nick. There's take anything more. good. Count on it. Yes, I do. I am counting on you doing this. So, you got everything? Yes. I'm not interested in the pen. Alright, so we got whatever was downstairs. Some supplies. Nothing too... I think there must be something up here. I found the tannery key. I'm not entirely certain what this is there for. More duct tape. Vacuum tubes, okay. What is the tannery key for? I wonder. Was that for... Was that for here? Hmm. Maybe it was. There was also something 
like, you know, going downstairs. I'm not sure if you remember that situation. Um, I think it was over here. And there's still the ship that I have not checked out yet, but I'm going to do that at the end. Let's risk a little more light. There. That's the door I was talking about. Requires the tannery key. There you go. <laughs> um. Oh, wait. That's just the other exit. Ah, okay. Okay, okay. That's fine. So it's... You, so you don't have to go through... That's boring. No, it's not boring. It's like... Um, lazy. That's. I've been casing those ghouls for weeks, waiting for an opening, and you dive in and choppy chop, bang bang, and the whole lot of them dead. You even know what you got right there? A premium set of Pelman's power tools. So. Pelman's power tools. What's the big deal about these tools? Pelman's pumps out more foot pounds of torque than a death claw and psycho. And before oh. Polly ran off, he kept those tools shiny. Nothing like them on this island. Period. Okay. I remember commercials for Pellman's tools. Expensive stuff, but top of the line. What the hell's a commercial? <laughs> Wait, it don't matter. Oh, Mariner sent you, didn't she? Goddamn Mitch and his big mouth. No matter what she's offering, it's nothing. Serious builders were given arm for them tools. I'll pay you 2,000 caps right here, right now. Deal? Um... Oh boy. No, I don't think she would do that. Um, Ellison is relatively straight, and, and um, I'm fairly certain that Nick would not appreciate. Plus, I want to finish that quest. Why do you need the tool so much? I got my own special projects. For the caps I'm paying, that's all you need to know. Does he want to build a nuke or what? Nah. I'll pass on the offer. I ain't hanging around forever. Walk away from this, and you'll regret it. See, Nick liked it. And you'll regret it? Well, I walk away from this. He will probably attack me. I hope I get the 2,000 caps for it. Sounds like there's a lot of shooting going on. Uh, maybe later. Right now? Hey, didn't I? There you go. There he is. Oh, Fragmentation like grenade. Automatic combat rifle. Heads Here, up. Nick. Why don't you take his do. weapon? Um. Get yeah. that. Sure thing. Pick that up. Can do. Take that. Good plan. Let's just loot him blank, so we don't risk. Missing out on anything. More ghouls. Lots of them. Does anyone know about these subway tokens? If you do, um, and do know what to do with them, just, you know, give me a hint in the comments. I would appreciate that. I have no idea what they're there for. Aluminum canister, a lamp. I don't care for any of this stuff. But, this is interesting. Um, finally, I found a mine. But I will need to drop some stuff now. Uh, what do we got? We got this. We got... Maximum capacity hair trigger. Combat shotgun. Hang on. Yeah, it does... It does do a little less damage, so I'm not taking it now. I might at some point consider... Um, Look alive. Here. Not get that rifle. Why don't you take that? I might mod it. Get that pistol. Get that Grab pistol. Grab that gun over there. Done and done. Yeah. So... 
I still expect this guy to attack me somehow. Because if he really wants the tools and has a special project, that's kind of what these people do in the world, right? They just get pissed and then they try to kill you. Which wouldn't really do him any good, I guess. Oh, thank you. Alrighty. Cool, let's have a quick look at the status of our quests. Um, I should give the Marin and the Duels. I return to Cassie. And I need the Wind Farm Kill Switch code. Oh, hang on. But that's for a different quest. Still. Well, uh, it is not close. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to end this episode here. Time is up anyways. I'm going to return to um, the, uh, the cabin. Maybe build a little bit there just to make sure to have some sort of a forward base. Like defense and stuff like that. Uh, set up a recruitment beacon maybe. And then uh, we'll take it from there. Um, see you in two days, would say. Yeah, and then we are going to level up. I think about what I know, what I need next. So guys, thank you everyone for watching. I hope you did enjoy it. And I see you. Until then, I'm Stordia. Bye.